Hello, Henson Level here, and uh, I had to uh, uninstall and reinstall my screen capture software. So I'm going to um, I'm going to put it to the test, post it, and see what I need to fiddle with. So let's do that. Going to play as my warlock and see what that brings me. I've only recently started playing ranked play through the first several months. I just did uh, a small amount of arena and then basically casual play and practice. So we'll see if my uh, Warlock's deck holds up against the Warrior. All right. Uh, let's see. I'm going first. Uh, let's do that. See if I can get something a little cheaper. All right. At least I got something to play on turn one, and I'm going first, so that's something. Oh, cool. <clears throat> I'm not exactly. I'm not exactly sure what kind of uh, warrior he might be playing. Um, I just think a warrior is being really aggressive, uh, having abilities that uh, grant weapons and buff your weapons and your your uh, creatures. So we'll see what he does. Alright, so... Alright, I'm probably gonna destroy this guy and draw a card off of him an acidic swap booth which could prove to be very useful against the warrior at some point I imagine he's going to uh, arm himself so doing alright e. alright I sometimes get a little concerned when someone's holding a lot of cards, uh, mostly because of my paranoia. Um, I need to feel, familiarize myself more with what other uh, with what other classes can do because I think the warriors do have something that can attack everybody. Let's see if he buffs it up. Okay, he's not. Um, I don't know if I want to play my sit up swamp boost because he's already got one durability lost. So I'd be worried down the road if he could um, uh, that won't really help me now. I'm just gonna let he he has to hit my taunt. And then I can kill him on the next turn unless some weird buffy thing happens. If he somehow buffs the scab and makes him big, then I can do that if I have to. So we'll see how it goes. Alright, so he's got a taunter. But fortunately, alright, he's wasted his weapon. His taunter is fairly weak, and uh, I can get some of my health back, killing him. Um, I'm not sure I want to use that. I mean, I could, but I might, I might draw a silence. Um, so I'm going to draw a card. And end my turn. Don't know if that's the right call, but that's the one I'm making. Alright, so two damage, three, that's five. Let's get six there. Okay. So I could deal this and this and deal five damage to that guy, and he'll have only one left. 
Uh, uh, let me just. Um, so I draw. Okay. Draw a card for each friendly character. For each day. Okay, so he drew one for himself, and for. All right. So if I draw him, all right, that gets him down to five, and I get the blood imp out there, and I can just pop him for one on the next turn, and the blood imp is gonna pump him up. So that's probably the way I want to go. Okay, that's fine, I guess. It's going to have to be because, oh, he can't target me though, can he? Good. Um, he's got charge. He's going to hit me, obviously. All right, so I can kill the crazed alchemist easily enough. Um... Four, four. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. Get some health back. Deal some damage. Uh, uh what do you do there? Okay. All right, fair enough. Okay. All right, so I can kill that guy straight off. I'll take some damage, but I can get it back, so that's not a big deal. Let's do that. Okay. Heal. And I'm going to draw a card. Don't know if I can turn this around. All right, so he's already he's already um, destroyed a damaged minion. I don't know if you can have more than one of those in a deck. Can't quite remember. Alright, I do not want him to gain very much more armor, because that's going to be a problem for me, if he continues to do that. So I do want to, I do want to knock that down. I know there's certain abilities where you can, uh... I'm actually going to take a risk and draw a card. Um... Okay. Now, as it stands, of course, he can't kill either one, but... Okay, so... I'm still okay. And he's still armoring up. I can silence his taunter. I could do this, which I think I like better. Um, all right, so if, if this guy somehow stays alive, I can uh, I can get him to deal ten damage. Um, hmm, I don't want to draw any more cards. I'm one. All right. I hope that's the right play. We'll see. If he can't deal with this, I can make him be a real pain in the ass. Okay, that's fine. Okay, plus two attack and charge. Okay. He's armoring up. 
All right, let's see what I can do. Um, I've been holding back my acidic swamp ooze, and I'm going to continue to do so. I'm still worried about a weapon. Um, okay, that really sucks because um, I don't have a way to heal. Um, yeah, I'm 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 dead. Four. Nothing I can do. I've got twelve. Well, at this point, it doesn't help. That does. All right. Well, I'm kind of glad I didn't give up. All right, so now he's all committed. He's destroyed his hand, so unless that can kill me or silence me, I should be able to survive until that thing dies, and I've still got 10 health. So, all right. Awesome. He can't even attack me. So I'm hoping that I'll be able to silence something if he brings something out. If he equips a weapon, see he's he's gonna armor up every turn. That's he has to. All right. Uh, how do I want to do this? Go and do that. I'll take one damage, but that's fine. Um, and I've got four remaining. Do that. And next turn, I basically have him. Unless he can do the, unless he can kill me on this turn, I think I've got him. That's all right. That was probably worst case scenario for him. All right, that's not going to help him. All right, so I'm showing 13 and 3 is 16. He's got 14, so... And I got him. So... Cool. Streak bonus kicks me up to 17. Nice. Very nice. Oh, cool. Yeah, I got quite a bit of money right now, so... I'm probably going to keep doing arena runs. I'll post another arena run, uh, and I'll try to adjust settings, uh, maybe get some feedback on, you know, if I should change the music or or change the volume of my voice or whatever. So um, that's going to be it for right now. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll be on again soon.